Before we talk about the impact of the goal, talk about the goal itself. Take us through it from the moment that you catch that puck in center zone. Yeah, I see Zooks jump out of the box and he's pressuring him, so I'm hoping he just, you know, throws it up my wall. Um, you know, I pick it off and and I go in, I see him lay down, and I, I just try to, you know, be patient with it. And, and the way things have been going for me, putting the puck in the net, it's, it's nice for that one to go in. Now to the impact. Could you tell what it did, not only to who were on the ice at the time, but your entire team? I think anytime, uh, you know, anybody scores a shorthanded goal, it lifts the team. Uh, you know, when you're trying to kill and keep the puck out of the net and you, you get a boost and you get a shorthanded goal, no matter what time of the game or what situation, it, uh, it gives you energy. You go to the third period, tied at two. What was the mood like in here, and what was the message that you guys took out in terms of how important this was? It's the most important, you know, period of our season so far, and that's how we, we wanted to approach it. Um, you know, we had to do everything we could to win. We ended up getting another, you know, quick one uh, to put us in the lead, and then Nasher seals it. So it's a, it's a good third period where, you know, we have been successful in the past with our third periods. Does four goals give you the kind of confidence level that you need for these next two games against the same opponent? Yeah, it does. Um, you know, it's tough when you're not scoring uh, as a team. You know, obviously two in a row with zero goals. Uh, you know, to get some here tonight, to get a win, it, it propels you and gives you confidence. And, and you need it going against a tough Pittsburgh team coming in here. It seemed like the energy level was a lot higher tonight than it was Saturday in Montreal. It seemed like you guys forechecked better. It seems like you're going on the puck a lot better than you were Saturday in Montreal. Yeah, that's the way we want to play. Um, you know, the, we're on pucks and, you know, we wear them down. Derek, given where the team was after the last two games, coming in with two consecutive shutouts against, did you sense the the, the calmness that that goal brought you guys that early in a game? I, I think it's just, you know, at that time, it's, you know, we try to forget those games, um, especially when you're struggling to score goals, and you just, you're just you just trying to, you know, go game by game. And I, I know I sound like a broken record. I keep saying it, but that's it's so important in the short shortened season is just to, you know, learn from their last games and kind of erase it and get ready for the next one because they're, they're coming, they keep coming, you know, and the schedule doesn't get any easier. So I know it's probably hard to answer questions about chemistry because it could be fickle, but why do you think that threesome that you were on tonight worked so well? Well, Cali had a heck of a game and, um, you know, he seems to step up uh, at the right time for us. And, you know, Rick, Rick is, I've said it from day one, Rick is a special player. So it makes my job easy uh, building chemistry with those two. Four goals, a win. What does it do for this team's mindset and confidence level going into two games against Pittsburgh compared to where it was maybe just a couple days ago? Yeah, it's good for us. You know, it's good to score some goals. Um, but at the same time, you know, we got to get ourselves prepared for two big hockey games. Imagine everybody would expect, Hank, that the conversation about tonight's game has to begin with the play that changed the course of the game, and perhaps we'll see maybe the whole season for this team, and that's what Ryan Callahan did early in the second period. When he scores that shorthanded goal to tie the game at two, what kind of a lift does it give you and you think your team? I think it was the difference tonight. You know, it was just a big relief being back in the game. Uh, I just felt like it, it turned everything around for us. Um, and also we're coming up big on the, on the PK. Um, which is huge this game, and, and uh, I think overall we, we play a really strong game tonight. Coming into the game with two consecutive shutout losses, you guys get a goal, what, 19 yeah. seconds into the game. What Did that have any kind of a calming effect on you guys? I think it, we always talk about it. When, when you score goals, it, it brings confidence to the group, and um, even though they came back strong in the first, uh, I felt like we were uh, doing a lot of good things, and we played with a lot of energy, and um, again, that second goal, uh, it, it was definitely the, the key moment in this game. Tell me about the lift that what Ryan Callahan did there early in the second period. You go in on the two-on-one with him. When you see that puck go in and it's a tie game, what kind of a lift did that give you guys and the team? Uh, it's, it's a great great play by Cali. Uh, I told him afterward, don't mind me. Just I'm, I'm just there. But, uh, yeah, no, the whole... Uh, Garden who was in the roof there and uh, gave us a energy boost the whole team and um, yeah from from there on I th I th yeah I, you really get the feeling that this is gonna this is gonna go the way so and then the penalty kill the entire night in, in addition to scoring that goal was was really terrific and very much the difference why do you think the penalty kill was so strong oh, I mean uh, I had three penalties so I'm just happy that the boys uh, stepped up and uh, and helped me out there uh, but I mean. Aggressive. He got Hank back there. Um, boys blocking shots and sacrifice himself, and just give that gives the team a real boost too. Uh, that's the same as scoring goals. You playing kind of 
penalty kill and, and killing off that, and that gives the team a lot of boost. So, uh, yeah, all in all, a great game, and, um, yeah, happy for the win.